What's going on family? It's the white from Clark's Fire Training and Safety. And today we're gonna do our over thousand round review for the FM 509 Mid-Size MRD. Let's go. Like I said fam, today we're gonna do our over thousand round review for the FN 509 mid-size MRD. And I can honestly say this firearm is amazing. Uh, let's first, let's make sure this firearm is clear. She is clear. Um, first glance, I'll show you guys uh, what we did to it. We didn't really do too much to it. Uh, just put the string light uh, TLR7 on there. Put the hollow sun, the gas pedal, and we put some uh, some grip tape on here. The FN uh, grip texture uh, is already good, um, but I wanted to put this grip tape on here. It just added uh, just a little bit more to it, man. It made it a little bit more comfortable. But like I said, the overall grip texture uh, for the FN is amazing. Um, what extensive shooting with the grip te texture does kind of irritate your hand just a little bit. That's why we put this grip tape on here. Um, overall, this firearm is amazing. It already comes with suppressor height sights on there. So adding this hot, this hollow sun was a no brainer. And also adding this gas pedal just <sighs> adds a lot to the firearm as well. My overall, Thoughts of it, uh, this is my favorite um, everyday use firearm uh, that we have. You can use this thing for concealed carry, uh, range fun. I've even shot a competition with this thing. To me, it's an overall firearm that everyone should have. Uh, we didn't want, we chose this model because we didn't want the tactical version with the threaded barrel, in my opinion, I would never put a suppressor on here, so there was no need to get the threaded barrel, in my opinion. Uh, I'm not for suppressors on pistols. Whatever, that's just me. Maybe I'll come around to it. But like I said, that's why we got the MRD midsize and not the tactical. I didn't want the threaded barrel. Um, I saw no, no point in it. They look amazing, though, with the threaded barrel, but it just wasn't for me. Um, I had my reservations, honestly, at first about this trigger again let's make sure this firearm is clear I have my reservations about this trigger this hinge in the trigger as you can see i thought this trigger check the brake on it the reset that's that's good man but anyway i thought this trigger i thought i wouldn't like the trigger honestly um but me personally after shooting this for a while you don't really notice the trigger. You don't notice the hinge in the trigger. Um, like I said, it, it did take some getting used to, but once I got used to that trigger, man, it was a beauty to shoot. Still is a beauty to shoot. I've thought about upgrading the trigger, but every time I have it in my car, I say, nah, I don't need it. The firearm is fine the way it is. Um, so I'm not gonna upgrade the trigger. I'm just gonna leave it the way it is. Do you guys have an FM 509? If you do, let us know in the comments what you think about it. Are you thinking about getting one? Let's talk about it, man. Hey, check out our website, Clark's Firearm Training. Dot com. Be sure to click on the affiliate page, man. There's a lot of good companies on there to save you guys some money. Again, this FM 509 midsize MRD is amazing. Got a feeling the compact is on our on the way to us as well. Hey, it's the white from Clark's Firearm Training and Safety.